what's Gucci, my symbiotes? Venom back at it again. All right, so this is gonna be a um, a pickup uh, video as well as a custom video, cause uh, I've been telling everybody that's been watching my channel that I'm that I gotten a couple of customs and uh, I've just been waiting to finish them so that I can actually show them. But uh, I finally show uh, finished the last one. The other two are just kind of a uh, uh, a real quick little accessory fix, but uh, I'm gonna start it off by uh, doing the, the customs first. So the first one I got, y'all might have saw if uh, if y'all are on the Facebook uh, Syndicate Facebook page, but uh, I showed this dude right here. Now I know some people have been talking about like actually fixing him and stuff, and maybe you know. I don't know, I guess maybe like their own gripes about them, but uh, let's see if I can get them more in the light. So I painted his his pants uh, like a matte black, I hope it's showing, and then y'all know I do a lot of thrift uh, shopping, so it's not the best, you know, I still need to tinker it up a little bit, but this is like a... Um, now, this is like a like a pirate jacket basically with no sleeves but I decided to paint it the same black color as his, as his uh, as his pants and then I just went in and painted the inside a red color to give him you know that that uh, that vampire look to him and then I got this gun right here uh, off of a uh, I want to say his name is Jack Cooper. He was a he's a um, color tops, but it's like a sidearm gun. So I just stuck that on it, being that to me it looks kind of like the gun that he uses in the first Blade movie. Um, it does have a little hole in there, but it was actually like a little peg. So I took that out and set him up right there. This is my next custom, which. I quite really like this one a lot. This is the gambit that I got from my friend Doug. Shout out to him. Uh, I actually made this playing card out of a, uh, what do you call it, a business card. And the flame is the same, is, is also the business card. And I painted it with like this, uh, red amber color for like uh, for, for models basically you, you um, use it for the, the brake lights but I thought that came out really cool and then I just used the red pen to to write the A and the, the, the heart in and let's see, you might not stand that's cool and then I, I and then I made him a staff out of basically a coat hanger. I might have to like chisel, I mean, saw this down. And then I just painted it a, a silver color. And heck, it basically works just as good. A lot of people that I've shown the car to think it's pretty dope. I mean, it was really hard to get that, that flame effect out because I actually did this with like a, a razor basically. But I've done stuff like this before, so I've gotten quite better at it. I mean, it has kind of, you know, bent a little bit, but I kind of like it that way because it makes it look more flamey, if that makes sense. But, uh, yeah, so that's, that's those two. And then this is the really big custom that I kind of took a long time doing. And, which if, um, if any of y'all follow me on Facebook, then y'all probably have seen this one. This is actually that, I'll probably put some pictures of it. This is that Bass Pro Duck Dynasty truck that I showed um, in one of my later uh, videos. I completely went out on this one. There's some little extra tires in the back. 
these lights are actually painted. Oh, I'm sorry, hold on. Let me go back this way. This is actually the, where you would have put the horses at. And detail the light inside there. This top black color is actually a semi-gloss color, so it would have actually came out around the same sheen, but I, I ended up painting this like a, a flat, clear color, and it ended up making it look like this kind of like color you're seeing, like it, it's kind of matte, but then it has a little sheen to it as well. And I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get in there, but The inside is all detailed as well. Let me see if I can kind of get it into the light for y'all. Like I've told a couple of y'all, I actually do custom Hot Wheels and stuff like that, so I'm already big on customizing stuff like this. The, the seats, I actually pushed them back so that a Marvel Legend could fit in there. There goes the inside. So, I mean, it's not perfect, man, but I mean, it's, you know, it's up to, it's to my liking. I dig it a lot. A lot of friends that come over, check it out, and I think it's really dope. I even painted mirrors on it. I like that it that the windows are kind of down, so if you have somebody sitting in there, you can already they can uh, see out. And it's cool because the winch actually works too. Just get it back up. I mean, it's not a. Uh, I have been asked too, like, what kind of truck is it, and. I don't think it's a, like an actual model. I mean, from the side, sometimes it looks like a Ford. To me, from the front, it looks like a like a Tundra or something. But I don't think it's a certain model. So, I mean, it looks dope. Kind of how we do it in Texas. We ride high. <laughs> Listen. So, yeah, that's my little like uh, Blade Mobile. And then, uh, and then I'll show y'all what I picked up. Uh, Might have caught a glimpse of it by the figs. So uh, I have been talking about this in my past videos. I'm kind of late on the in the game of getting these dudes, but. I've been really wanting to get them ever since I had saw, I want to say it was Plastic Addict's uh, video on them. And he had them all put together. So I just decided, hey, you know, let me get my try at it. Because uh, I, I used to watch the cartoons back in the days as a kid. So, you know, I wanted to get them put together and stuff like that. Hold on. All right, so here they are, completely all together. Sorry about the mess in the back. I picked up the, uh, the red line first, cause at that Walmart, I'm sorry I didn't get no footage either, but it, that both of these Walmarts that I picked up all of them at, they kind of just had the same ordinary stuff there, so I didn't I didn't decide to to uh, record and stuff, but. I mean, at least you can see what I got. So I picked up the green one, the yellow one, and the blue one um, uh, yesterday. And I picked this red one up first, but they, that's the, that was the only one that they had there. But so I went back uh, the following day and I ended up getting the, uh, the black one. That's my, my little that's little Venom Jr. playing with the black one already, but I'm gonna put I'm gonna get these out of the box and I'm gonna set them up. I mean, so yeah, 
Let me go ahead, pause it, and then I'll come back. All right. All right, y'all. So this is them out of the package. <laughs> Set up. Um, I don't have a stand right now, so I could actually, like, form them in front of y'all. But the next clip will be them uh, formed. I mean, I'm quite sure y'all kind of really either y'all have them or y'all seen uh, Shardimus' video. So, I'm gonna skip to the next scene. Oh, let me see. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm gonna skip to the next scene, y'all. And y'all see them formed, all right? Hold up. All right, y'all, you know what? I'm gonna have my little boy hold the camera and I'm just gonna transform them in front of y'all, all right? Cause I, I kind of feel that I would be, you know, doing the wrong thing and not showing y'all how it is. So, there goes the first line. If I remember correctly, I mean, I'm going off of just pure uh, memory. Remember this goes in, but mine is kind of hard to stuff back in there, so I kind of have to like spin it. Let's see. All right, there it goes. So there goes the yellow one. Uh, let's see. If I remember this correctly. A little bit more, so I can see. Okay. Stop the telling. I think the, this one. Up, son. Right there. Oh, my hair is hurt. Oh, the blue one is a flip, too, so. Okay, so that's one foot, and two feet. I should have stand better ones. These are the ones that were kind of tricky. Hope I don't get bashed for this, but like I said, I'm going off of memory. Oh, so there is a compartment. It does open up. Okay, so... Okay, so this one actually does go in. And then this closes down. Watch your finger. Okay, so there goes his arm. I open this. Okay, there it goes. Get his arm in there. Get this arm. Okay, stuff that in there. Okay. 
and we're closing. tired all right so legs go in This is a certain mode that it's supposed to be on. Okay, so I'm gonna put the first foot in. Sorry. Dope. So that would be, let's see, next one coming up. Get the yellow. All right. There goes his legs. I'm gonna actually get him to stand. Be the. We need the 
Lion, ready for action. Red Lion, ready for battle. Green Lion, all systems go. Yellow Lion engaged. Red, green, black, blue, and yellow lions detected. Voltron operational. Bam. Dude looking mad though, man. Alright, so now we got the sword. And let me see if, if I'm correct. The way that Shardim is set to do this. Hold on real quick. So if you don't get no paint rub. He said it was kind of hanging loose. Alright. So I got it in there. He still is kind of like wobbling to the back, but it's all good. And then we'll stick the shield on real quick. All right, y'all, my bad. So, got him with his wings. And yeah, dude is looking well worth it, man. I'm glad I picked him up. Sorry about the, you know, the kind of little low budget uh, put together, but you know, I'm still in the process of getting all my stuff fixed and um, getting a, a good stand and stuff like that. But I mean, at least y'all can see I got mines put together. And uh man, I, I I I love it, man. I'm gonna have him set up in my in the symbiote cave or sanctum. And uh man, I can't wait to uh, the next big ass put together and stuff. Big big put together like this again. It'd be nice to see a Megazord or Dragonzord like this, but I mean, I know they have them, but they're not as nice. I mean, I see Nate Simmons. Shout out to Nate Simmons. Shout out to Shardimus. Uh, you know, putting these together as well as I, I seen uh, Nate's vid where he has the the Dragonzord. And it's not as big as this, which would have been dope if it was, but I mean, it's all good still. So yeah, I'll see y'all in the next one, alright? Bye y'all, Venom out.